Hi there, today's recipe is homemade cornbread muffins with corn tidbits. The corn just gives the muffins an extra boost of flavor, an extra boost of sweetness. You can barely taste that they're there, but they definitely make a difference in this mix. So let me show you how we make it. First, we'll show you what you need. Some cornmeal, flour, milk, of course the corn, an egg, some sugar, and also some oil. This cornmeal mixture is kind of like a blend. It's by Aunt Jemima, and it has flour, it has baking powder, it has everything you need in there, but I also still like to add flour as well. So all you do is add all your dry ingredients to a bowl, and I like to go ahead and mix them together before I add anything additional into my bowl. So just give it a good mix. All right, and then we'll go ahead and add our next ingredients. So you go ahead and add your egg in there. All right, and there's our oil. Okay, so the next thing we're gonna add to this recipe is whole milk. You definitely want to use whole milk for your cornbread muffins so you can have that nice southern down home taste. All right, I always like to add my milk a little bit at a time. I recommend adding it a little bit at a time, even with exact measurements. I never want to add too much milk and I always want to make sure as I add it, it's really fully incorporated into the batter. So add a little bit, mix a little bit, add a little bit, mix a little bit, and don't forget to scrape the sides of your bowl so you're getting all your mixture into your ingredients and mix well. It's starting to get a little thin but I want it a little bit thinner. So add a little bit more milk here and continue to mix. All right, it's about where I want it to be. So I'm gonna get ready to add my corn. There we go. Not too thick, not too thin. So just pour your cold corn right into the bowl and mix that as well. And after you have it pretty mixed pretty well, you're going to go ahead and add it into the cornbread muffin pan. Okay, so I'm using the cornbread muffin pan that I use all the time. I always use cooking spray, even though I never have any problem with getting these muffins out of the pan. That's why I keep this little vintage pan around. So I'm using about a half a cup measure to add my cornbread muffin mix into the pan. I add mine to they're about, what is that, maybe a half a centimeter from the top. I never have a problem with them overflowing, so I always fill my um, sections pretty full with the mix. Okay, after you have all your mix added, all you wanna do is pop them in the oven for about 20 minutes. And about the 18 minute mark, we're gonna check on the muffins because you can also turn on the boiler if you want your muffins to be a little bit brown at the top. So I'll show you right here. They're a little pale, and so you turn the broiler on for like, I don't know, maybe about 30 seconds to a minute. Make sure you watch it very closely. And look how those muffins just came right out of the pan, nice and golden brown. Grab some beans, some greens, some cabbage, and have a nice home style meal. Please don't forget to like this video, share, and subscribe to our channel, and we'll catch you next time. Thank you.